Okay, so YouTube, this is going to be a how to handle your geckos. Um, so Ben is just out of his cage. Um, what you should do is just offer your hand like this, and they'll usually just walk right on it. Or you just kind of scoop them up from behind their legs. Then you do the hand over hand. Alright, so that's for a leopard gecko. Now, leopard geckos are a really easy gecko to handle. And uh, so are African fat-tailed geckos and crested geckos. Now, geckos that you don't want to handle are day geckos, toke geckos. Uh, there, there's a bunch of them, like anything that's really small or has delicate skin or if they're really aggressive. So that's for leopard geckos. Moving on to fat-tailed geckos. Okay, so what if your gecko is really squirrely? Well, she just went right behind here, and that that wasn't too fun. Um, I just got to make sure she's okay. Seems to be all right. Um, so what you do is do a hand over hand motion, where you offer another hand. Um, start with light handling, like five minutes a day. But for handling, you don't want to handle your geckos, um, whoop, see, um, if you just got them, or if they're under six months of age. So I'm just going to put her back, because she's getting really squirrely and I don't want to have her get hurt anymore. Okay, how to handle your geckos for African fat-tailed geckos. Um, you don't want to just go right into them. You just start slowly, put your fingers um, right behind their back, their back hands here, and you just lift them up, and there you go. Oop, sorry, it kind of hit you in the face there, little girl. So these are just normal uh, stripe morphs, beautiful stripe going down their back. Sorry for the little voice crack there. Okay, and then you can just let them climb up and over your hands vertically. That builds up uh, muscles in their arms. So it's the same thing. I'm just not going to hold her right now because she's eating. Okay, so how to handle your crested gecko. Well, he's on my finger, and just keep in mind, crested geckos do like to jump. Um, just walk him over. Maybe hold your hand out, they'll jump. Let's see if he'll jump. Kind of. Um, now what you don't want to do with crested geckos is have any weird kind of um, clothing. Like you want to keep them off of fuzzy stuff and Velcro. Um, it's okay for the crested geckos to go on a t-shirt, but it's not necessary. Okay, so how to handle crested geckos. Hold your hand out, they will jump trying to get her to jump. She's looking at my hand like she will. What's the matter? Something sneezy? Oh, she just pooped all over me. <laughs> 